I'll be so tough that all the other pirates and all the marines will bow at my feet. Everyone in the world will know my name. That's gonna be the legacy I leave behind when I die. Everyone knows that one of the most emotional deaths in One Piece is Ace's death. But what broke my heart the most was not his death, but his flashback. Now here's the thing, Ace's background story is not a sad one, in fact, it's the complete opposite. It's quite a happy one because we see him overcome a lot of things. Ultimately, we see him overcome his past and set out to become a pirate, which has been his lifelong dream. But what makes this hard to watch is the fact that as you are watching this story, you are reminded of the fact that ultimately Ace is going to meet a tragic end. I just wanted to take a moment to tell you that Jesus loves you. Dude, one of the things that I cannot get over is how messed up it is that Oda, the creator, decided to give us a flashback of Ace's life right after he passes away. Right, during these flashbacks, we start to see this character grow, going from being alone to developing not only great friendships, but slowly overcoming all of these inner demons that he has been struggling with his entire life. But while you are cheering him on, you cannot help but to remember, to be reminded of the fact that Ace is dead. He's no longer with us. We're not going to see this character evolve any longer. We're not going to see Ace change. We're not going to see him evolve. We're not going to see him grow. We're not going to see him develop any cool new firepowers. Well, thinking about all of this, it actually reminded me of Jesus' life. Now, in the Bible, you have the four Gospels, which pretty much tell the story of Jesus from different perspectives. And in these Gospels, you see Jesus' adventures. You see him interacting with people. You see him helping people. You see him battling you know, these hypocrites of that time. And ultimately, these Gospels end with Jesus being crucified on a cross. To be honest with you guys, I found myself not wanting these flashbacks to end because the minute that they ended, I would have to face the reality that Ace was gone, right? All of these dreams and aspirations, poof, gone. Luffy would no longer have a brother that he can depend on and can rely on or go back to when he needed. All of these gospels end with one fact, that Jesus' body was never found in the tomb. But for those of us that believe scriptures, we understand and we know that he rose on the third day. Which means that ultimately, even though the gospels to an extent are showing Jesus' life and we can no longer interact with him, if you will, we have the hope that one day we will meet him again. All right, guys. Well, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that it was helpful. Listen, if you like this content, make sure to share, like, and subscribe. That way you don't miss any upcoming videos. And I just want to say thank you for your support. And as always, I just want to remind you that we must persevere.